hey loves so this is the look i'm going to be showing you guys so i've already gone ahead to do my brows i've applied my primer off camera so what i'm doing right now i'm using i used a black opal finishing deluxe powder to set the primer to keep it in place now i'm using for my transition color i'm going to be applying a powder the first shade is lighter the one i'm applying right now is a bit darker than the first one then the third one i'm going to be using a more precise pencil brush is going to be the darkest and i'm going to be placing that in my crease then afterwards i'm going to be going into my glazy eyeshadow palette I'm going to be applying this bronzy shade i'm going to be applying it to the center and the sorry in the outer and the inner uh, inner corner of my eyes and i'm going to be using a real technique blend the brush to blend that together then i'll go back into that same palette taking a more darker bronzing shade so i'm going to be placing that just to create a dimension in my eyes then i'm still going to be going back to blend that so i'm just going to be doing one eye for you guys in this tutorial so that i won't make this video too long and boring while i'm going to be doing the other eye off camera so it's the same palette i'm going to be picking a teal eyeshadow color placing that in the center of my lid so for me to in order for me to make it pop and make it look nice i'm going to be going into a loose liquid a loose glitters and a liquid glitter i'm going to be applying a teal color glitter which is the liquid one then i'm going to be setting it with a loose one then afterwards i'm going to be going into a loose glitter which is good so i'm going to be placing that slightly in the center of the ones that i already applied so that it doesn't mix up too much that's why you are seeing the gold glitters a little bit popping out in the middle of the other ones that I already applied so i'm just going to be replicating what i did on my lid or at my lower lash line and afterwards i'm going to be applying my gel liner which is from kyrite as you all know that i'm so stuck and so obsessed with kyrite because it's it's waterproof and it's very very nice super dark very nice so i'm just going to be using i'm not going to be using the applicator that comes with this gel liner i'm going to be using a pen liner which for me it's i mean it's lifesaver it works super nice because it's very precise and it gives me control so i'm going to be using that to create a inner wing liner in my eye and also to also conceal any obvious space in my lash line and also use a white pencil to open up my eyes a bit so i'm going to be applying that in the center of my rim my eye rim just to make it open up a bit actually i was inspired to make this look by gabriel's franco i stumble upon his instagram and do and it does a whole lot of beautiful works and i love 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 them a lot so i had to like do one of his look guys what do you think about this eye makeup look it's super nice for me and what do you think about this short tutorial guys because i i think i want to be basing my tutorial more on high makeup look if i'm going to be doing a full makeup look guys i'll let you guys know but i think i'm going to be basing it on high makeup look so that you guys have a very quick and fast tutorial for you without wasting so much of your data and please guys don't don't be scared to subscribe please i notice a lot of people when you ask them to subscribe they're always scared if they are going to be taking their money or something it's free guys it's just like when you are subscribing when you are following someone on instagram or adding someone on facebook so guys this is the finished look this egg hair was inspired by me i have a tutorial on this egg hair already if you haven't seen it i'll leave i'll leave the link in the description box please don't forget to subscribe don't forget to share this video please leave me a comment just for me to know what you guys would like to see next Thank you so much guys. This is the look and I'll see you guys in my next video.